Hey guys, in today's tutorial I'm using the new Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette and creating a fun bright look for Valentine's Day. First I'm highlighting my brow bones with a matte light pink shade and then I'll be defining my crease with a bronzer for a warm glow that will peek out underneath the other shadows. Then I'll be defining my crease just a little bit more with a mocha brown shade. To prevent the shadows from fading throughout the day and help them look brighter, I'm putting a base down for both of the colors. I'm starting with the purple liner for the purple shade on the inner and outer corners and gently fading that towards the center. And then I'm applying the white jumbo pencil in the center of my lids to make that pink pop. Once I have the base down, I'm taking the purple shadow and packing that onto the inner and outer corner. And then I'm gently blending out the edges so there aren't any harsh lines. And I'll be connecting the inner and outer corner through the crease. I'm blending just enough to give a little bit of a smoky effect, but I'm making sure to leave the center blank because that's where I'm applying the pink shadow. I'm applying the hot pink over the white base and gently blending it into the purple so that way there isn't a line between the two shades. For a really subtle liner, I decided to use a soft coal black pencil Smudge that into my upper lash line and then layer the purple over it so that way it isn't harsh, but just gives a little definition to my eyes. Next, I'm filling in my brows and applying some mascara. For this look, I'm using all matte products on my face. I thought it would balance the look out since the shadows are so bold. I kept the lower lash line simple and just smoked it out with the purple shade and then I'm highlighting my inner corner with shimmery pink. To finish the face off, I'm contouring a little bit and adding some bronzer and highlight. I used a cool toned bright pink liquid lipstick from Too Faced to finish off the look 
I thought this went well with the shadow and was just another fun pop of color to add. Here's the look all completed. I had to do just one more tutorial before Valentine's Day because I think it's so cute and I love all the colors that go along with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look and that you all have a happy and fun Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!